And at the Jersey Shore, a pest is making beachgoers uncomfortable. They're complaining of red, itchy rashes after swimming in the ocean. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo has more on what biologists call sea lice. Well, just hearing the word sea lice has many people scratching their heads. Sea lice? Like a bug in the ocean. <laughs> um, I've had lice myself, so I'm thinking things that just come out of the water and go into my hair. I have a mullet, so you got to be very careful keeping that intact. They're called sea lice. It doesn't affect your hair, but it leaves behind an itchy rash on the skin, and it isn't pretty either. It's nasty, <laughs> but thankfully nothing's happened to us this whole week that we've been here. The rash seen in this photo from the Florida Health Department comes from stings from the sea lice that are in fact a tiny sea creature called thimble jellyfish. These tend to live in very warm waters down in Florida, but because it was such a warm, hot summer, they've come north. There's been reports of swimmers getting sea lice in Avalon, Stone Harbor, and other South Jersey beach towns. And it's just another concern beachgoers are dealing with during these uncertain times. There's a pandemic that's going on. It's bad enough as it is. Now we got to worry about the jellyfish. And the rash may feel like mosquito bites, but you can find over-the-counter medicine to treat it. In Ocean City, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.